Hi, I'm Carl from Huawei Developers, and welcome to Develop with HMS Core. Today, I'm going to show you how to integrate Huawei in-app purchases. Huawei IAP helps you focus your attention on app innovation, while leaving time-consuming work to us, such as integrating global payment methods and guaranteeing regulation compliance. Huawei IAP makes it easier for users to make payments and boost your in-app purchases. Huawei IAP has three typical features. First, product management. It supports automatic pricing for products at 195 price levels using 78 languages and local currencies in over 170 countries and regions. Second, order management. Huawei IAP opens multiple order management APIs, records all order information, and proactively tracks the order status to prevent product deliveries from going missing. Third is subscription management. Huawei IAP enables the management of subscription relationships, subscription periods, subscribe products, and promotional activities to help you gain a stable revenue. Moreover, Huawei IAP supports most mainstream payment methods, including bank cards, carrier billing, Huawei points, and other local payment methods. It also offers a sandbox testing environment and practical integration guide for your easy access. Now, you may have figured out what Huawei IAP is used for, so let's start integrating it. First, open Android Studio, create a project, select Empty Activity, enter your app name and package name, and then click Finish. Now sign in to the Huawei Developers website and access the console. Go to Huawei App Gallery, My Apps. Now click New to create an app. Then specify the app information and click OK. Now click the Develop tab. From the message that appears, select Manually Enter the Package Name and enter your package name. Make sure it's the same one you used when creating the project. Once you've confirmed it is, click Save. Then click Manage APIs and make sure In-App Purchases is enabled. Go to Earning, In-App Purchases. Click Settings. Then you'll see the public key for payment signature verification. Go to the Operate tab. On the product management page, click add product. Fill in the required information and then click save. Here, click OK for the settings to take effect right now. Go back to the develop tab. Under app information, download the AG Connect Services JSON file. Next, place the configuration file under the app directory. Open the build Gradle file, add the Huawei Maven repository and the app gallery connect dependency. Then open the build Gradle file in the app directory. In this file, add the app gallery connect plugin and IAP dependencies. Add app signature information. Open the ProGuard rules profile and add obfuscation configurations for the HMS Core SDK to function properly. Open the main activity file. Here, I'll show you how to display, purchase and consume products. First, let's check how to display a product. Add the load product method to obtain the product list and display the list after listening for a success event through the callback method. Use the create product info request method to create a product info request and set necessary parameters. Make sure the product ID you enter here has been added in Huawei App Gallery. Then use the IAP client to send the request to obtain the product data. Then add the go to pay method to purchase a product. This method is triggered when a user taps the information of a product. 
use the create purchase intent method of the IAP client to purchase a product. Set a callback listener for the request results. After a purchase order is created, an unsuccess callback will occur. Open a new page to complete the payment. As the payment is performed on a new page, check the payment results in on activity results. If the payment is successful, call consume owned purchase to consume the product. Finally, add the consume owned purchase method to consume the product and set a callback listener for this method. When the product is successfully consumed, the on success method will be executed and you'll see a consumption success message. We've now finished our coding, so let's try it out. Open the demo app. Here, a product has been loaded. Tap the product to go to the payment screen. Select a payment method such as Alipay and tap the pay button. Once the payment is complete, you'll see this screen. Tap OK. Now you return to the home screen and a consumption success message is displayed. That's all for today's episode. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments area below or visit the Huawei developers website and be sure to hit the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.